Here we are. My son had enough sense to put one of these boards up overhead in the drive. <laughs> I didn't even know about it. Well, get me started and I turn the camera over to my wife, my camera person here. I done marked it all. I want to turn the power on. Oh! Break your neck. We're waiting for the power to be turned on. Now we're waiting for him to get hung up again. Bet I never make another one of these confounded things, but I grew with the tree. <laughs> Do something with it. Oriental chestnut. And my dad planted it in 1959. Long time ago. It's pretty stiff. Pretty stuff. Sawdust gets in your eyes, in case you don't know people. Now, what are we doing? Yeah, we're going Please would tell us we're going inside. Inside the bad saw, or it's a little warmer out of the wind. No, out of the salt. That's because he don't clean, he keep the shop clean. If he would keep his shop clean, he would not have this problem. But <laughs> you don't know, he doesn't know how. Well, Thank you. Made a little effort last week, I think it was. I clean it. Well, I'll be done. I clean it. <laughs> I clean it and he messes it up. Ah. So, people. Me and my wife wanted that thing yesterday. <laughs> That's because we didn't look there. Is this where you want me to stand, or do I need to stand on the other side? Good question. It's not a good I question. I, I guess this thing still works. <laughs> <laughs> Don't ask me why, people, what he's doing, because I'm not sure myself. I would have had more light in <sighs> Let's stand right here, and maybe y'all can see... The lights off, so we'll heat the wheel out. He's all gonna the, tell all you. I may have to darken that up where I can see. Maybe I can. I can't see it. Can you see it? No. Well, then why <laughs> do you even know what you're cutting? All right, now what are we hunting? Bantle. Wayne. One of them things with graphite in it. You see that? Y'all. Hey. One day he will be able to know where his pencils are. He does not get old blind here. And he wants to mess with the cook if with well, the Saba says he says he's blind. Oh well, he's not blind. He just can't whatever. Oh, the doggies. We have a dog in the next door neighbor's dog. Y'all might hear barking. It's upset. It wants somebody to play with it. To go hunt. Nobody take him. It's hunt. Wants to go play. He won't go chasing blind wild hogs. No, he wants to chase cats. He wants to run his job. Get some chalk over here and do it with chalk. <laughs> Y'all, maybe he'll get started doing something in a minute. I am doing something. Oh, excuse me. He says he's doing something. Let's see what he is he's doing. Looks to me like he's playing with a pencil. I'd give anything in the world to come up with a blind pencil. Somebody could see on dark colored wood. Show to somebody out there in the world makes one. They do. You know them colored pencils won't work on wood? Well, 
We're wasting time. Ooh, I'm gonna have to sell a little oil. I'm get that in here. Mm -hmm. And he got it hung. He has a dull blade. That's how you saw it, people. See? You saw it like that. Now you take and you put your and you don't fall down and you get real down, real, real close. Folks, I don't build them the way other people do. <laughs> I've had a thousand people tell me there's easier ways to make dulcimers. Yeah, but I build them using clips. I don't do them junk. Mm -hmm. It don't pay to make musical instruments. You make more money off building junk. My nose itches. He's coloring it again, in case y'all wonder what he's doing. Trying to get where I'm sitting. You get 73 year old, you go blind as a bat. You know. Y'all want to see some sawdust? I can show you some sawdust. Hmm. Ding dong, let's go.
back in sawdust again in my nose. <laughs> Saw bands hold. Yeah. Everything in this shop used to be made by craftsmen. I called my mama work for craftsmen. <laughs> Two got a 15% discount. Yeah. You never know. Most of them give out and wore out and all that good stuff. Now where are we going? Oh, here's this little plane again. Do we have to do it? Got to move a ton of stuff. He needs a thing to just sit here to hold this thing while he does all this. Oh, that's me. Why didn't you? Folks, I don't do anything that makes any sense. Move the flashlight. <laughs> Move the flashlight out of the way. There's a big folk school up in North Carolina. I won't mention the name or where it's at. But the original one, my grandpa built the building <laughs> in Asheville. And they moved it. They got people. They good meal folk. Art Center, it, when I was demonstrating making these things up there, uh, anyway you do it, <laughs> I made it. I go, what in the world are people talking about? I got to think about taking that course, a two week course. You spent two weeks up there camping and learned how to build ulcers. I, I, maybe I'd have a piece of diploma so I could turn that. <laughs> Yeah, guess what? I like laying myself to death when I see my right thing up. Yeah. They build a dulcimer and sit and watch you glue it together for two weeks. And it's made out of cardboard and black. <laughs>
You want to need some glue, aren't you? Yep. Folks, this thing got hit by a tornado about five years ago, and it's twisted and cracked the living lard out of it. I figured I'd end up being more glue than wood. <laughs> oh, Lordy, Lordy. Ha, ha, ha.